Hi guys, welcome to my weekly grocery haul video. I just picked up all of our groceries for the week from Walmart. This is my first video of 2024, my first grocery haul video. So I'm gonna share with you everything that I got in the grocery pickup, lots of healthy stuff for this week. With the first of the year here, you know, always trying to start the year off as healthy as possible, trying to be a little bit more active, but definitely trying to eat really nice and healthy. So if you're new to my channel, make sure you click subscribe. I share with you all of my grocery hauls and meal plans for the week. I also share with you lots of other recipes and meal prepping as well. So make sure you click subscribe. Hope you had a really great holiday season. Let me show you everything we got for the week. All right, so here are all of the groceries. If you've been around my channel, you know I spend $200 a week is my grocery budget. So this week we were at $200. I was actually at 201, um, but I did get some bottled water that I didn't put up on the counter. So all of this plus a case of water was $201. Uh, this is for myself, my husband, and my two boys for the week. So I will start over here with what we've got. This here is salmon. We love salmon. We have it about every other week. My kids, they, they beg for it. They absolutely love salmon and it is so delicious and so quick and easy to make. I have our chicken breasts under there. We go through a pack of chicken breasts a week. Um, and then I have chicken drumsticks on the very bottom right there. I'm going to cook them in my crock pot and they're super good. So that will be for dinner one night this week, salmon for one night, Chicken we'll have for dinner, but also my husband um, takes it to lunch a lot on sandwiches. I use it for salads, so we grill up a whole bunch each week. This is the kind of bread that Benjamin likes for his peanut butter sandwiches. The boys are still on a break from school for uh, the rest of this week, and Benjamin's been having lots of peanut butter sandwiches. Um, these are sandwich thins that my husband uses for his sandwiches at uh, for lunch that he takes to work, uh, tortilla chips, can always get these almost every week. They're so delicious, the cantina style, thin and crispy, so, so good. Croutons, I'm going to have a lot of salads this week, so I love to add on some croutons to give it that good crunch. We needed some ketchup because over the holidays, I left our ketchup at my parents' house, and so definitely needed to get one of those at our house. Um, a big box of storage bags, the gallon size. I just get the Great Value brand. I think they're just as good as Ziploc and way, way cheaper. So these 80 bags will last us quite a while. Our favorite snack ever, if you've been around my grocery haul videos, you know I get these pretty much every week. Pistachios, nice big bag, whole family snacks on these. A gallon of, we do whole milk, and then some almond milk that my husband uses for his smoothies. I have a big bag of shredded cheddar cheese. I'm going to do a casserole this week, so I want to make sure we have enough shredded cheese. Uh, some Parmesan cheese that I will have with my salads. Chicken Caesar salad is my absolute favorite salad. I can have it literally every single day. So uh, the croutons and the Parmesan will go with my, my lettuce here for my chicken Caesar salads edamame super quick and easy and my kids love it you just steam it in this bag so we have it with dinner as our vegetable side um, under here is our carb balanced tortillas my husband eats these like they're going out of style um, five carbs per tortilla and this is the burrito size so super healthy 110 calories um, and really good they are, have a really really awesome taste um, and there's only, there's eight in here. I almost got two packs because we ran out this last week, but eight should be plenty for this week. Frozen strawberries for smoothies. And a couple weeks ago, I got this Southwest blend and I used it in my stuffed peppers and it is really, really good. It's been a while since I've gotten it. So I got it again. I'm going to do burrito bowls um, for one day this week and it's just way easier to buy all of these veggies already chopped up. It has bell pepper, onion. So like when I usually do um, burrito bowls, I chop my own bell pepper, my own onion, which definitely I always like to do fresh produce, but this was so, so easy and super cheap and convenient. So a bag of this, a big, huge bag of broccoli. I did not order this big, huge bag, but they substituted it 
I ordered a smaller bag, but we eat a ton of broccoli. And with the salmon, we'll have broccoli and salmon and rice. And I like to do like a little teriyaki bowl with broccoli. So we eat a lot of broccoli. So this whole bag, we'll definitely eat it all. Um, got some butter back here after the holidays. We went through a lot of butter during the holidays, so I wanted to stock up. Um, got some mac and cheese. We're going to be watching my parents' dog in a few days, and he loves macaroni and cheese. <laughs> so he's very spoiled. He eats a lot of human food. But so I wanted to stock up on mac and cheese. These boxes are only 62 cents, so we have a bunch now. And like I said, the kids are on break from school, so it's been cold and wet out, and mac and cheese they kind of like sometimes for lunch. Um, I got two boxes of this oatmeal. I Actually, this was a substitute as well, like the broccoli was, but I, I just got a 20-pouch box, but they substituted it for two 10-pouch boxes, which is fine. Um, corn, black beans, some tuna. My husband and I love tuna. My kids actually, too. Zachary really loves tuna. Um, yogurt tubes, get these every week. A big box of pancake waffle mix. Um, like I said, the kids are on break, so we're having like some more kind of special breakfast that to, yeah, I can spend some time cooking them. So we've been doing waffles and pancakes. They love them. And it's a nice little treat because it's been like around the holidays. Cottage cheese, my favorite snack, super high in protein. Love it. Uh, under here is the vanilla Greek yogurt, and we go through one of those a week. Bananas, go through a ton of bananas in this house. Avocados here, get them every single week. Um, apples, got 10 apples this week. I hope it lasts us. My family just eats apples up a storm, so I'm always trying to make sure we have enough. I got some zucchini down here we'll have for dinner one night this week blueberries, lots and lots of fruit. We go through lots of fruit, especially when the boys being home from school, lots of fruit snacking. Green tea, my husband and I, we don't drink coffee, but we do drink green tea. So there has 40 tea bags in this one. I like it, it's just a great value brand. Um, and it it's a good one, I really like this one. Light buttered popcorn, There's 12 bags in here. So this lasts us a couple weeks for sure. I got some wheat thins, cause I'm going to do a dip uh, later this weekend and it, uh, wheat thins are really good on the side. Um, a big thing of old fashioned oats. I have been making a lot of green spinach muffins. I made a, two batches last week. Um, so definitely needed some old fashioned oats for that. Really good in those blender muffins. Two boxes of Cheerios. If you've been around my video, I always explain that I get two boxes at a time because there's a little clippable coupon that saves a dollar. So if I buy two, I could save a dollar on the two boxes. So this will stock up our pantry for a couple weeks. Um, this brown and serve sausage, it's delicious. It's the uh, Vermont maple flavoring. It is very, very good. So this kind of been, I've been having this for breakfast with my eggs and then I do some avocado and some shredded cheddar cheese. And it is a delicious breakfast. I've seriously been having it every day for a while. And two 18 packs of eggs. We go through a lot of eggs. So uh, two 18 packs will last us through the week. But these are all of the groceries and what we're having for all of the days this week. So I hope that you enjoyed this grocery haul. Hope that you have a really, really awesome start to your new year. And make sure you subscribe to my channel for lots of healthy recipes, lots of meal planning tips as well. So make sure you click subscribe. Hope you have a really great rest of your day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.